Yo, welcome to the channel. My name is Further Warrior X, and she don't want to, bro. You not cool enough. Like, subscribe, new, hit the bell for another case. Let's go ahead, get straight to it. I'm sorry, but if a guy picks me up in certain cars for a date, I'm just not going. I'm sorry, but you can't tell me if someone pulls up in this. Hold on, put it on the screen. Hold on. This Prius. You're the uh uh. The Prius. <laughs> I'm sorry. I know the type of person you are. Like, I can tell oh, what like, car what? you drive, what kind of person you're going to be. Wait, I'll show you another. And this is for the boys, too. If y'all drive these cars, you need to reevaluate yourself. No! Oh, wow, that's that Brian Griffin car. <laughs> the only person that Y'all drive driving this for real. My 90 year old grandpa. Y'all like this for real. The only person. Okay, hold on. One more. I've got one. She really more. going off on y'all. What what's going on here? Be for real. But, like, you get that? Now let's be real here. She is talking about most average guys. Average men, a whole lot younger men, don't just have the money to just go buy their dream car off the lot. I'm just gonna be real with you. A whole lot of these women talking about what car you should drive. Be driving that Nissan Altima. Y'all know which one I'm talking about. Like nobody wants to date somebody that has a bomby car. Nobody wants to date somebody that has bomby stuff in general. But the thing is, you just can't judge somebody just based off of that car that they driving because you never know. Especially when you meeting somebody new because you never know what that person really has yeah. it could be doing really well for themselves and you could be a part of their life but hey don't let the car stop you sis stop judging men by the car they drive oh ain't that what i said i know some millionaires that drive in the regular truck and some broke dudes riding in the mercedes all right babe you ready i'm a plant baby i was born ready all right babe. all right here you go what the f this? this must be a joke i know you're not serious right now babe what are you talking about i just got you a tesla <laughs> is your favorite color. No, it's not. <laughs> What's the problem here? You're the problem here. Daddy was right when he said you would treat me like dirt. This is basically a Prius. What are you talking about? This is a Tesla. You spoke. Reality is they're just some bird brains that's just ungrateful. I mean women. <laughs> if you buy them the earth, then they want the other eight plants to go with it. Go get your money. Go get your house. Go get your car. Because a whole lot of these entitled women are entitled for no reason. They want you to have all this so you can treat them like the queen that only cash can't treat them like. And a whole lot of them don't even deserve it in the first place. <laughs> Meanwhile, man, while you complaining about what car I'm driving, I'm laughing to the bank in my Mercedes. <laughs> And like sometimes girls will look at me like, yo, like I remember this one girl had the audacity to be like, yo, why would I talk to you? You're driving a, you're yeah. driving a Kia. Yeah. So I, I'm, uh, I'm a prick. I'm like, how much do you make? Yeah, yeah, she no, told I, me how much she made. Exactly. How much do you think I make? Yeah. Mm. So she said, I'm like, okay. So I showed her how much I make. Mm. How much do you make on pocket watches? I'm just. <laughs> <laughs> I make, I make, I make a good amount of money. Thank God. Six I make a good figures? amount of money. Yes. I make a good amount Ladies. of money. I thank God. So, I, yeah, I <laughs> so when I told her that, she's like, oh. I'm so sorry. Da, 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 da. Oh, but so if you if you make this much, why do you drive a Kia? Because I'm I don't want to spend a lot of money. Oh, bro. Like... What's up, my guys? Listen, some cars are not gender neutral. If I see a dude driving any of the following, I will not be a co-pilot in that vehicle. Number one, a hybrid anything. I'm all for a Starbucks loving blonde chick named Courtney driving her hybrid Corolla. It just goes with her whole Save the Turtles vibe. But if I see a guy I'm trying to <laughs> in some green e. I'm immediately drying up like a fucking Sahara. Anything under a BMW 5 Series, even worse if it's not an M, that's a chick car, bud. An Audi TT. You're kind of like the choir kid that tried to fit in with all the football dudes. Wanna be? Get an RE and move out of your mom's house. Number four, any Corvette. Controversial? Probably. But it's a midlife crisis car or a newly divorced dad car. You're begging for validation, Steve. Number five, a Miata. It's cute. And that's exactly why you shouldn't drive it. Let me put it this way. If a girl looked at your and said, it's cute. How would you feel? Also, it's a convertible, and men in convertibles give me the ick. A sports car with a four-cylinder engine and automatic transmission. Chick car. Whoever told you size doesn't matter was wrong. The Mini Cooper. I'm sure that's not the only mini thing about you. You'd look more attractive on a tricycle at this point. And lastly, 99% of SUVs. You know what? I heard they're giving out free car seats when you pick up a new CRV. You better run to the dealership, Frank. I'm gonna go ahead and end the video off here. Like, share, subscribe, new. Hit the bell for the notification. I will catch you next video. If you enjoyed this video, then share with a friend, share with a family member, and I will catch you in the next video uh see you later okay bye